Alright, so this deck right here, its main goal is to bring out Da'ata, the Draco Mecha Soldier. Uh, this card right here is in the new archetype of monsters that was released uh, really recently called the Draco Warriors. Uh, are they called Draco Warriors or just Draco? No, they're called True Dracos. Oh, okay, True Dracos. Anyways, like a day or two after I put out my True King uh, video, they released a whole bunch of new support for the True Kings. Uh, the deck I made before is, I think, is better than this one because this one is focusing on trying to get out Da Ta. Uh, anyways, the new True Draco cards, they have special effects where you can tribute spell or trap cards, as long as they're continuous spell and trap cards, as if they were monsters. But it's not uh, a special summon, so you can still only bring out one of them per turn. Uh, so you can't spam them out. But that is a pretty good effect, especially since their spell and trap cards do support that. Uh, and Da Ta requires three tributes to bring himself out. But uh, he's unaffected by the effects of the cards used to tribute summon him. So if you tribute a monster, spell, and trap card, he'll be immune to basically everything. Which is great. And uh, he has 3,000 attack, which is also pretty nice. But if he is destroyed by battle or card effect, uh, you get to special summon a monster from your extra deck that's not light or dark. So it can be an XYZ synchro or a fusion monster. Well, it specifically designates those ones. I got a whole bunch of fusion monsters and a synchro in here for a whole bunch of various situations I could think where if this guy gets destroyed, uh, what kind of situation would I be in and what monster would be allowed me to like turn that around so that's what all these guys are in here for for a bunch of various situations I could think of based on decks I usually go against uh, so yeah that's the deck the deck mainly focuses around bringing out down and top. if I was gonna put it more uh, focused on like the true Dracos and true uh, Draco what are they called true Kings like working together the deck would be a lot different, but it's not. It's about going into this guy right here. If I was going to make a different kind of deck with focusing on the new true Dracos and true Kings, I'd probably only include like one Da Ta at most. Since while he is like a really good boss monster, he does eat up a lot of your resources and it's not really necessary to bring him out in order to win because the other cards are really good on their own.